Hi, welcome to Love and Forever Evolving, where we are always and forever evolving. Hello, Lions. Welcome back, my loves. Welcome to your love reading. I hope all has been well, Leos. Hope you've been taking care of yourselves. Shout out to the beautiful soul family. Thank you all so much for your continuous love and support. Yes, it is always an honor having you here with me. I, I appreciate you. And welcome, welcome. Welcome back to my returning beautiful subscribers. Thank you all so much for your comments and your feedback. I always read and listen to your feedback. Thank you so much, loves. All right, you guys keep a smile on my face. Thank you so much, Leos. I enjoy getting into your energy here each and every time, okay? So no further ado, let's see what's going on this time, all right? Let's see what the energies here bring for you when it comes to love and romance, all right? Let's see what's coming towards you when it comes to love and romance. Gordon Angels, Ancestors, what do we have for Leo placements here? What do we have for my lions? What's coming towards Leo for love and romance? We're going to see also who is in your energy and why. And then most importantly, how do they feel, right? So let's go ahead and dive into it, Leos. Hit that like button, all right? That'd be very much appreciated. It helps the channel to evolve and grow and get the message out into the algorithm, all right? Thank you so much, Lions. I appreciate you. How does this person here feel that's coming towards the Aries? Let's see what's going on in your love life. Oh, that card came out quickly here. Okay, so we have here the Six of Swords. This is air elements here, Lions. All right, as well. Some of y'all, this person here that either may be coming towards you or you, Leo, may be leaving the situation or this person that's in your space, your energy. Someone is in the space or mood here of being able to move forward here. Someone is finally now like getting into the boat, making that decision, maybe find themselves taking their family, their loved ones or whomever, and they're moving forward. Uh, you know, this card talks about going towards calmer waters, waters, um, being able to go towards the bright side of things in life and um, allow the situation to work itself out. So going into a new environment, some of you all could be planning on relocating here, Leo's, moving to a new city or new estate, maybe trying to start over and reset your space and energy for yourselves. I see for some of you all as well. Now, you may not be in the best space mentally because of situations and circumstances here, Lions, that may have happened in your past, but you do know where you're going is going to be a better space. It's going to give you a reset. It's going to start making sense to you and put you in a more positive energy with that red here showing that you taking back control of your life and stepping into that root chakra, your power. All right. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. Let's now clarify the six of swords here. Clarify the six of swords for Leo, please. Wow. Like I said, I always love tapping into your energy, Leos. <laughs> you never know what comes out for you. We have the three of wands. Yes, I love this energy you in. It's just so energetic. It's so positive. It's so fierce and fiery. And it's like that getting the job done, um, checking off that to-do list that you've been established for yourself and being patient and waiting for these opportunities to come in. I love the energy and how you're transmuting whatever the energy that you have to leave in the past here i love how you're transmuting that energy and bringing it to something to have an outcome of a positive outcome versus for what you felt behind a situation here in your past and that's what i love about this all right so let's see what else let's see who's coming towards you for love all right what's coming towards lions here for love We have the two of wands. This person could be a fire sign. That could be a Sagittarius, an Aries, or a Leo here. And then we have the ten of pentacles here. Taurus, Capricorn, and Virgo energy here as well. So this is someone I see you making a decision about here, Leos. Um, this could be, again, about you uh, moving forward or staying in a situation that you uh, manifested here from your past. This could have been the mother or the father of your child, someone that you were in a relationship here with in the past, someone that you maybe had a commitment here with, take it how it resonates for you. 
But the Five of Swords has also come out as well. We know the Five of Cups indicates some type of conflicts. Someone that is outside of you in your space and your energy that's causing conflicts with you. So this is why I feel like you, Leo, are deciding to maybe move on. Or this is where that energy getting in the boat, get catching that Uber, honey. Okay, and moving forward for some of you all here. Because of the person that kept, you know, doing all type of um, deceptional things in your environment that you didn't agree here with. Some of y'all, this person could have been Aquarius, a Gemini, a Libra. Or again, a Taurus, a Capricorn, a Virgo, a Sagittarius, an Aries, or a Leo like yourself, okay? Yeah, this person was in that space of feeling guilt and being a shame type of energy of themselves because of their choices that they made here. So someone has definitely been stressing out about this. This person that you left in this situation here, Leos, they're very stressed out right now. They're worried. Um, they're not able to get as much as a great sleep at night. They're very much in a low frequency vibration. It's all because of as well their negative thoughts. They have a negative thought pattern in thinking the way they do that I feel like that really has put them in in some negative situations and outcomes wow leos definitely if the reading here so far is resonating for you hit that like button again get this message out in the algorithm so it helps the channel to evolve and grow and definitely get the message out for who needs it okay just one word could give you a breakthrough on the whole entire situation right and bring you peace literally i have had that happen to me several times just hearing that one message or that one statement just really changed my perspective in life on how i manifested things so i appreciate each word down to the letter okay so let's now see this person hitting feelings here lions okay let's see this person hitting feelings here towards you how do they feel how does this person feel what are some things they want to say to leo what are some things here that this person wants to say to my lions Wow. Oh, well, look at that. Look at there, Leos. We got, I am becoming a better person. Well, 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 what I say, lions, okay? Someone now has realized that, look, this whole entire experience, even I feel like you feel that way because the positive energy is starting to vibrate off more, I see, on you. And then now it's going to eventually vibrate off this person to get them at this mental sword energy here um, and allow them to look at things more from a positive perspective. As I mentioned to you earlier, they were looking at things from a more negative perspective now they're going to be looking at things in a more positive perspective oh my goodness i was trying to get that out the best way i could without confusing myself or you okay i'm getting a lot of downloads for you leos i love it yes so let's now see here what advice do the universe have to give you all lions regarding this person or this situation for whomever resonated with the message here today what word advice or can my lions take away from the reading today, Spirit Guys. Thank you so much. All right. We got here work through your fears, Leos. All right. So, some of y'all, this zodiac sign, this particular energy right now is going to help you to get through whatever emotions, feelings, or thoughts that you have about a situation here. Some of you all could be exchanging energies with the Scorpio here, or this person could have been a Scorpio here that's very significant, all right? Or again, something here that you may be in fear of doing or believing that you can do or manifest for yourself, it's time for you to take that feeling or those thoughts out and know that you can do it. If you've already gotten to this point and you know that this is something that you have an ideal of that's a part of you, a part of your passion, then yes, you can do it. So let go of whatever these negative thoughts are, I feel, because it's keeping you from being abundant, Leos, okay? That's for some of you all that maybe are starting to walk into your purpose or walk into what you're trying to manifest for yourself or whatever this may be for you, okay? Right? This is a person or place or a thing. Work through your fears, okay? 
Wow, Lions. I love the message here for you. Again, definitely if the reading has resonated, subscribe, like. Be sure to set your notification bells again, Leo, so when I do go live on this channel for all Zodiac signs. And again, if you would love to extend your stay here, Lions, and come part of our Patreon family, that link is on the homepage where you get more exclusive perks from the channel. You get early access to my content here. You get free questions when I go live discounts for personal readings and plus more so definitely that's something that you're interested in that link is on the home page for the sign up all right thank you so much lions i love you and i wish you and this person the best all right Mwah. bye bye